privatization Interpol is missing. Brian Todd is on the story for us. Brian, what are you hearing? Wolf, we are hearing there are serious questions about what this man's wife knows in this case, but also questions about his ties to China's security apparatus. We are learning tonight the keys to solving this mystery could well be in Beijing. He's a top leader of Interpol, the world-famous global crime-fighting agency, an elite law enforcement official well-versed in security measures. But tonight, a deep mystery surrounds Meng Hongwei, who has vanished from his post in France, missing for more than a week. This is very strange because this is a very high-ranking position within uh, Interpol. Meng, a former top Chinese law enforcement official, was assigned to Interpol headquarters in Lyon, France. But a senior French law enforcement official tells CNN he was not on French soil when he was last seen. Meng's wife was the person who reported him missing. But even though he'd been missing for more than a week, she didn't tell police until Thursday night, French officials say. The French Interior Ministry says Meng's wife had recently received threats over the telephone and social media. The wife is going to be the key. Obviously, when, when did she last talk to him? They'll look at whatever digital footprint he's got. Uh, they'll look at his email, his official email that he used at Interpol. And there are questions about whether Meng Hongwei's disappearance is related to threats on his wife. Some reports say Meng returned to China, then disappeared. The South China Morning Post newspaper, known to have connections to Chinese authorities, cites an anonymous source saying Meng is under investigation for unspecified reasons and was taken away for questioning by so-called discipline authorities. He may well have been picked up for questioning, not simply about what his activities may have been uh, as a senior official at Interpol, but also what were his activities when, as a senior official in China, where he likely has interacted with other senior officials, some of whom have been purged. Analysts say the possibilities of what happened to Meng and what he may know are almost boundless, given the world he came from, the cunning and ruthless Chinese security apparatus. Any intelligence community, any especially internal security force, is always going to be deeply suspicious of everyone. Because, especially in the Chinese context, where you are policing 1.3 billion people, where you have to worry about not just uh, actual conspiracies, but internet-based conspiracies, criminal activities. The people who are very senior officials in this are aware of the habits and tendencies of a vast swath of the population. This is a country where the right to privacy is not even a figment. The Chinese government so far has not commented on this case. Analysts say if Meng Hongwei was brought back to China for questioning, we may not find out about what happened to him for quite some time, probably until some brief announcement by Chinese officials about possibly some kind of punishment. Wolf, what a story. All right, Brian.